Go ahead. You look great. Good morning. I chose an article from the Baltimore Sun by Scott Dan because it was interesting and I learned something new. I did not know that just because doctors and nurses have to be state board certified they, to perform plastic surgery, the facilities where the procedures are performed are not always subject to inspection or oversight. In fact, a move inspired by the death of a locker room woman Maryland health officials may, um, asked state lawmakers for permission to oversee plastic surgery centers. Apparently, within the past month, Monarch Med Spa and Timonium has had one patient die and two other patients sickened after undergoing liposuction at their facility. According to the health department, these patients contracted infections um, from the same bacteria that cause strep throat and other common illnesses, but is much rarer and more dangerous when infecting the skin and other body parts. Some plastic surgery centers fall outside of regulations because although the law specifically permits um, health uh, officials to regulate abortion clinics, the code is unclear when it comes to other surgery centers. A state law pa recently passed in 2010 added some state oversight on plastic surgeons, but it didn't ad address these surgeon, um, surgery centers themselves. Under the law, the state board of physicians or can discipline doctors who perform certain cosmetic procedures in unlicensed or unaccredited facilities. However, the law does not apply to liposuction procedures in which a certain percentage of fat is removed or any procedures in which only local anesthesia is administered. Accrediting organizations typically inspect facilities every two to three years to review safety and infection control procedures. However, Monarch does not list any accreditations on their website, nor are they among the certified surgical centers listed by the Maryland Health Commission care, care Commission. Therefore, before undergoing any invasive procedures, patients need to seek out information on a center's accreditations and licenses. So in other words, if you don't see any hanging on the wall in the waiting room, then you should be asking some questions. Thank you. Thank you. Nice work.